I'm Vanessa Canby and in this video I'm going to take you inside a supermarket in Accra, Ghana. There is cheaper places to shop such as markets, growing your own food and other kiosks that you can buy food from locally. How much was your coconut? Wow, that's good. Let's see. So it's like pieces of coconut. Yeah. Yum. But if you are looking for some imported goods, this is the sort of place you can come. This is inside Max Mart, but there's also Koala and Palace, which sell similar things. Basically, you can get anything that you can get in the supermarket at home. So I'm just going to show you around as I've had some queries to figure out what imported goods you can buy. So here is like the organic section. Um, so rice cakes, 23 Ghana cities. Again, we've got free from here. An organic food. We've even actually got Waitrose organic quinoa in here for 38 Ghana cities. Dog food, so there's a whole aisle of dog food. They even have Waitrose wood pellet cat litter. Um, so let's say you went for the pedigree, 43 Ghana series. You can get all the milks, all the alternative milks here as well. Um, what I normally go for at home is unsweetened almond and that is 17 Ghana series. Joseph finding something for himself. Rude Health actually, actually I also get that, so that's 44. Six Ghana series here. So as you can see, you can actually get all of the cereal here. So let's say I went for cornflakes. That's 22 Ghana series. Sell a lot of like Waitrose products in here, which is obviously from the UK. Milo, 16 Ghana series. And again, all the spreads you could want. Let's say you went for Nutella, 61 Ghana series. A smaller one, 32. You can get the Cabrets double decker, all of these different jams. If you just went for a strawberry jam, 17 Ghana series. And you can see the equivalent price, so I'll figure that out after. Okay, so here's the coffee aisle. You're getting all of the same coffee. This is the one that my husband takes. And here it's 60 Ghana series. So let's see the sugar. So if we went for two kg of sugar, be 10 Ghana series. Oh my gosh, my favorite part of life, which is obviously the tea aisle. So let's see what I would normally get would be peppermint tea and here it's 59 Ghana series so normal tea 14 Ghana series you even get like the cake mixes that was 32 Ghana series and then there's all sorts of flour the flour was like normal flour so let's just say this one's pasta flour but that's 20 Ghana series and um, 41. We've got all the spices here. Let's choose one spice so we can compare. Oh wow, they've got Nando's. Right, let's go for pepper, 12 Ghana series, ketchup and everything. What's this? Pulses, chickpeas, etc. Oh wow, they've even brought Uncle Ben's. 22 Ghana series for one packet. I know for a fact that that's one pound at home. And so I think that's what, three pounds here or something. Oh, 
Okay, so for kiwis, these are obviously imported. Kiwis and everything. We can see the prices, apples. So they have all sort of yogurts and cheese. Let's just see this yogurt, 32 Ghana CDs. And then butters and cheeses. So these cheeses. 65 Ghana CDs or what else have we got here? Okay, so a loaf of bread is seven Ghana CDs, 90 pesos. Bagels. Three Ghana CDs? Wow. Depending on what bread you get, it's different price. What do you mean these things still exist? They're pegs. They are pegs, but we don't we normally use them anymore. I've, it's been a long time I've seen them. What do you use instead? Use the plastic ones now. The plastic ones, yeah, but the wooden ones are actually better for the environment. Yes, but people don't buy the wooden ones. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already. And if you have, thank you so much. Also, I've recently started a Patreon. If you want to support this channel, I will put a link in the bio for that and I'll be uploading exclusive content over there as well monthly. And so you don't want to miss that. Some live Q&As with me. See you soon.